Emma, welcome to another great day at Citrus Grove Elementary. Please rise for Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated. And now for the announcements. All Eagle families are invited to Science Night at the Grove on Tuesday, April 4th, from 6 p.m. to 7.30 p.m. Daytona Beach Museum of Arts and Sciences will be providing an inflatable planetarium and exciting hands-on science activities in the cafeteria. Fifth grade student science projects will, do, will be displayed in the Media Center. There will be lots of fun things to do at the Grove on Science Night, so make sure you join us. Teachers, encourage your students to earn enough for some cafeteria expectations. Teachers, encourage your students to earn all three Eagle Bucks for following all the cafeteria expectations and take time each day to find out how many Eagle Bucks were earned and why. Students, use inside voices, eat your food, stay seated and raise your hand, use kind words, clean up your area, keep hands feet and keep hands feet and objects to yourself. <coughs> At this time, we want to remind everybody, everyone that our school uniform policy is that students must wear any shade of blue, green, or white shirt, short sleeve, or long sleeve collared shirt with khaki, navy blue, black blue, or black denim bottoms. Shoes must be closed toe and closed heel. Teachers, please check your students at this time and send any student that is missing one of these items to Ms. Hulo's office. Breaking news, do you like to cook? Receive a breakfast cookbook when you buy school lunch on March 29th. And now over to Ms. Williams. Good morning, Citrus Grove Elementary. This is Mrs. Williams with a few words of wisdom. When was the last time you flew a kite or watched a kite flying? What keeps a kite in the air? The wind, right? But is the kite flying with the wind or against it? Former British Prime Minister Winston Churchill once said, kites rise highest against the wind and not with it. Opposition is something working against us. We all face opposition and problems during our lives. But when we face our problems, when we don't try to run from them or hide from them or pretend they aren't there, we become stronger people because we learn from our problems. We let our problems, like the wind to a kite, lift us up to a higher place. If you find yourself up against a problem today, make it like a kite. Face it head on. Talk to an adult you respect and you'll be a stronger, wiser person for it. With something to think about, this is Mrs. Williams. Make it a great day or not. The choice is yours. Today is our first day of third grade FSA testing, so I want to remind all of our other grade levels that it's quiet campus and we have to be quiet everywhere we go during lunch, special area, or if we're going to the office. The media center will be closed until we send out an email saying it's back open. Today, I need my first graders to come right down to the office and meet me there for positive referrals. For Ms. Grover, congratulations to Irvin Simmons. 